Hello, everybody, and Hello. welcome back. How you doing there? I've got uh, what's your derby name, Alexia? We're gonna call Alex you Alexia. Um, my derby what's name derby was name? Uh, Rock Starling. Rock Starling. Oh, yeah. bad. I'm Nasty Moves. I'm joined by uh, Alexia. Yeah. And we're gonna bring to you uh, the third game of uh, this weekend here at uh, Skate Around Number Five which has uh, Namur Roller Derby playing Roller Derby Madrid. So tell us uh, more about the roster on the blue side of things. Um, so the roster of Namur is 0-3 Knappi, 1-2 Ninon, 1-2 Sivan, Sailor Min, 1-3 Chaton, 1-9-5-7 Batsmash, 2-4 Alin, 2-7 Gelis, 3-9-3 Grumpin Up, 3-9-4 C. 4040 Pimus, 537 L'Enroule, 89 Pulp, 9 Jackie, and 934 Tinker. Wonderful. That's going to be uh, it's going to be some good news there. We've seen them play once already today. For Roller Derby Madrid, we have uh, 112 Colerica Sara, 33 Lethal Cath, 417 Iron Didal, 52 Bambi Killer. 5-1 Ija de Odin, 6-6-6 Tank Girl, 6-7 Mercury, 7-1 Garider, 8-1 Angie, 8-6 Hawaii, 8-7-7 Margaquita, 8-8 Nanaza, 9-1 Fleur du Mal, 9-2 Dame Venena, and last but not least, 9-9-7 Paula. Oh. Yeah, because you saw, well, yeah, yeah, I know, because you saw them play. This is their second game and their second game in the a row. The second game of the both teams. Of both teams, yeah, yeah. But these ones were in a row. Mm. Namur had a time to have lunch. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Sorry, that's the way it goes. And the both uh, wins uh, win our uh, uh, last, uh, last game. They both won their last game, okay. indeed. Namur won their game against uh, Auvergnac, a 188-77. to And as for Madrid, they finished with 243, which is a great score against uh, Vienna Roller Derby 116. So we've lined up now, and we're waiting for the, uh, yeah, to start off here in the third, the third game, a few seconds. Let's go. Let's go, yeah, you want to get going, I get that. So let's have a look. Oh, Namur gets the lead. I'm oh, sorry, Namur, yeah, does get the lead right off the, no, Madrid. Na oui, That's yes. my fault, thanks. See, there you go, they're in red now. I have to get used to it. Madrid coming in for a scoring pass. Uh, that's not so much good news for Namur at the moment, but look at all look at all that wallage here in the front. That's a lot going on. So we still looking for yeah, we're all calming calming down there on the Madrid side. Do we have we finally have a lead? No, we don't. No. We just have a jammer coming up. I'm getting it all wrong. What's going on here? That was a star pass? Yeah, there, there was a star pass. The, you're in, yeah, thank you for that correction. There was a star pass. Everything happened so fast. So no points for Namur and four points there for Madrid. Thank you for that. I thought, what was going on over there? We had Namur playing in red in the first game. Now we're going to no. follow it up. So again, Namur is in blue and uh, Madrid in red. I am not going to forget it. 4-0 now at the moment for Madrid. Okay, so for the second jam, we have uh, Gilles for Namur and uh, Dame Veneno for uh, Madrid. And Dame Veneno take the lead, takes the lead. We have a star pass and uh, L'Enroule uh, takes the, take the cover. Yeah, you recognize them right away. Yeah. <laughs> Number five. Three, seven. First scoring pass for Madrid and uh, calling. Yeah, calling already and putting another four points on the board. So that's no, that's, uh, that's fun stuff there for Namur. Namur has to get in there. And Namur had it, like you said, they they had a really good first game and Madrid yeah. had a really strong second one. Yeah. I think Madrid still have the adrenaline probably flowing in them because they didn't, you know, two games in a row makes a big difference. Yeah. Have you done that before, two games in a row? Yeah, I, yeah, I, I, uh, I played in Madrid oh, and uh, wow. we, we played two games. Yeah, and then you lead a lot of bananas. Mm. So we've got uh, Bat Smash and Paula, both of them uh, heavy rotation. Well, Paula actually more than Bat Smash. Bat Smash was not supposed to jam so much this morning, but did. So that was interesting. Oh, talk about smashing going right through the middle. We're still looking for a lead, though. It's taking more time. We get penalties before we get a lead. That's going to be 
Oh, a power jam then for Namur. Oh la la, le super jam, as they say in mm. French, right? <laughs> so it's all up to Bat Smash. How about you tell us what's going on there in front? Uh, Bat Smash uh, take, the, take the lead. Yay! <laughs> yeah, coming back in for scoring pass. And uh, in the inside, everyone's loving the inside today, but that Madrid's not taking that line down. They're going to make it difficult. Mm. For Bat Smash, Bat Smash is going to just keep pushing till they can get through. We know that. But look, these two teams are teamed up a little bit different. So I'm expecting them to maybe put some points on the board at some point. Of course, mm -hmm. you have to jam first. We ran down the clock. We've got uh, Jammer coming back to the track. Oh, oh, that was a nice hit. Someone ordered some takeout. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and uh, Paula uh, make a her first scoring pass, yep. so uh, four, four points from Madrid. No, ah, no points. No, it, no it points. No, it was the other points. No, I saw you were... It, it isn't uh, the scoring pass, it's the first... Uh, You're right, the yeah. first pass. No, that's good. I was looking at that as well. Uh, they had, they were doing a, what we call a star stash, and having a hard time putting their thing back up. But mm. if we look at the points, yeah, this means that uh, Namur finally put some points on the board. For four, that's good four. news. Yeah, it's not much, four point difference for now. As we go into the fourth jam. So for this jam, uh, we have um, Neneza uh, for Madrid and Ninon for uh, Namur. Ninon, a very powerful uh, jammer. She, she um, makes uh, a lot of, um, of points on every uh, jam uh, she makes. Yeah, we, we saw her play yeah. fantastically this morning, too. We recognize, uh, recognize her right wider, wider away, too, with the uh, glasses, number 12. Yeah. Usually um, also she, on heavy she, rotation. She takes the lead. That's good news. But um, the... Um, so, uh, and uh, she's calling. And that makes it another four points there for Namur. So we're just moving up fast in zero. Madrid, no points on that last jam. No points. Yeah, yeah. So, so we're uh, even, even. We have Steven. a inequality. In even, 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 even. <laughs> Sorry, equality. I wish we had equality. That's a whole <laughs> other discussion. But no, you're right. They're both. Uh, both teams are equal at the moment. Oh, yeah. We're off again. Gillis back in the in the saddle for uh, Namur, and, and a the, hop, skip, and a jump. That means that uh, Venina gets through. That's fantastic. That was very fast. Uh, we saw a lot of that in the last game that we watched too. Damn, yeah. it was really nice. And uh, we have a star pass for Namur. Chaton uh, takes the cover. Indeed, coming in for a scoring pass. But by the time we've said that, you know how it is, right? You get that cover, you finally put it on, call yeah, it off. Cool. Yeah. yeah, if you're lucky. We had one jam uh, earlier today where that didn't happen, but the jam was busy with something else. But yeah. mostly uh, at this level of derby, it's bam, 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 call it off as yeah. quickly as possible. Very quickly. Two for Madrid, none for uh, Namur. Very evenly matched. This is the most evenly matched yeah, match so true. far. Yeah. So we don't it's know anything can happen. <laughs> I'm allowed to say that three times during a game. I said <laughs> it once already. Oh, Madrid trying to so get to the inside. We have a long rule um, against against Paula, but Paula uh, um, takes a, a, a fault, so uh, she's in a box, and it's a power jam uh, for Namur. Yeah, indeed, Paula's going to have a little sit-down, think about what, what they did wrong. And uh, Lanroul takes the lead. Yeah, did some great work, too, this morning, too. Mostly star passes, but this time just went straight for it. And now mm -hmm. is asking their team, uh, Tinker, Aline, and friends, to move the red players out of the way. <laughs> Will that happen, though? Let's have a look. An offense. Lots of offense. I'm very offended. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, as a, I'm always offended. No, but this is fantastic. I always like watching uh, Namur. Namur, very surgical. That's a word we used a lot today, mm -hmm. and it's quite true. And uh, the jammer of Madrid uh, uh, is uh, back uh, on the track. Yeah, everyone's everyone's there. No one in the box. Good, good. Uh, but that doesn't make it uh, more easier right now. Uh, Madrid is uh, giving a hard times there to Namur. En route, yeah. saying, uh, j'ai fini, and just calls it off. <laughs> That's some pretty tight derby. This is going to be fun. If it keeps going this way, we yeah. have no idea. We can't have even an inkling of a prediction. 12 for Namur, 10 for Roller. Two point difference. Oh yeah, my. only Could two points. I know. 
it's it's tough. But we still have uh, 22 minutes and change to go in the first half. Mm. And we even have uh, more roller derby tomorrow. We'll be back to you tomorrow too as well. Uh, but we have a fourth game today. We'll tell you about that in a little bit. So uh, we have uh, Ninon for Namur who takes the lead against uh, Angie uh, for Madrid. And uh, Angie uh, make uh, her first pass passage. Pass. Pass. Just pass. Pass. No, that's good. Le passage de l'étoile, the star pass always sounds yeah. better in French because it all sounds better in French. Then again, there used to be a, a shop called that, so that's uh, quite a classic. Yeah, But indeed, oh, look, we've got a team timeout being team asked. Team timeout. Yeah, And uh, no points uh, for this game. No points at all, absolutely. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, that's a uh, that's tough time. So I can imagine, you know, you want to uh, go, hey, what's happening? Uh, three, three points, uh, ah. sorry. Three points for Namur. Yeah, we were too fast. Thank you mm -hmm. very much. Uh, so only a five point difference there for the at the minute, as the British would say. And uh, we'd like to tell you, I'm going to tell you already, uh, we still have one more game after this. We'll have Vienna Roller Derby back on track for their second game. And they'll be playing uh, Les Auvergnacs, uh, Auvergnacs from yeah. Clermont-Ferrand en France, uh, from, a, from very far away where it's good weather. Uh, Auvergnac to for Auvergne. Uh, Auvergne I is the region I, I uh, yeah. of France. Yeah. L'Auvergne. Yeah. 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 Get that. <laughs> We, uh, yes. With true, the true. They have their own... Uh, the vol yeah. Volcan. The Volcan. The Volcan. Oh, that's cute too. Yeah. yeah. Well, I, I was traveling through there last summer, so I know. Um, at the same time, uh, L'Auvergnac have had a, a two-game break too, so that's going to make a bit of a difference. And Vienna, uh, yeah, gets to play their second game. That's going to be at 6.15, so we're not there yet. We've got a while to go. And we're going to get back on track now again with, uh, let's say it again, because even we were getting a bit confused. Namur in blue this time. Yeah. And, and uh, Madrid, Madrid is in red. red. Las Gatas. That's their name. The team. With the tigers. Uh, Las Gatas. The Gatas means cat. But ah, you knew yeah. that, right? Ah, okay. It's a bit like Portuguese. You should know. Yeah. No, no. Yeah. In no? Portuguese, it's ga gatos. Ah, oh, then, okay, you say it better than I do that. <laughs> yeah. I've seen them play quite a, quite often. I haven't seen them uh, play in a while, so that's good. So a bit of frustration there, and with good reason, because we have a power jam for Namir, where Madrid jammers go to the box. I'm going to argue about it a little bit, too, but it's not going to change anything. So yeah. let's have a look at Namir. Tell us what's, uh, what's the number 27 of Gilles. Uh, Gilles is uh, uh, on the Madrid's walls, and uh, very uh, strong walls. But uh, the um, Namur bl blockers uh, try to uh, help her. Yeah, they're all over. They try and they yeah. try and encircle the other team. They've been doing that all day. And indeed, yeah. yeah, it's very nice. And she pass. That's the best part. Gillis, uh, do you get to it? It's Gillis. Gillis, my yeah. excuse. Gillis, thank you very much. Yeah, number 27, uh, heavy rotation the whole day. I'm so happy you know so much about these teams. It's nice to hear. Yeah. Perfect. Speeding it up there on the track. Yeah, very speed pack. Yeah, that's uh, that's uh, not good usually, but mm. you do what you can. Uh, Madrid is going, uh, no, we're not doing that. They're trying to keep it together, but they have to keep it packed together. Four more points for Namur. Both jammers on track too as well. Look at that. Yeah. So the Nasa two jammer, the two jammers are, are on the pack, on the track, and on the pack. They're all over the place. That's what's important. But they need to get through. That's what we want to see. We need to get through tough times then for both of them. Yeah, very strong uh, wall uh, by the Madrid. Beautiful. Madrid's. Yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, they don't. They practice a lot. Well, I think everyone says everyone practices, but they're they're trying to kill the the time. That's the most important part. Oh, it's going to cost a uh, penalty on the red side of yeah. things. A blocker in the box. Happens. And uh, and uh, Gilles called, so uh, end of the jam. Yeah, it happens that way too. We have uh, eight, eight points for Namur and zero for Vienna. Vienna. For Madrid. Uh, for Madrid. It's, okay. it's really it's really okay. I know you're getting used to it. Yeah. I'm, I'm extremely uh, happy to have you here because your expertise is. Uh, about these two teams is uh, better than most, so that's perfect. We've got, uh, we're going into jam nine if it's good, and we, but less than 20 minutes to go. So again, these teams are pretty tight. Namur is, however, taking a bit more of the lead. Pulp yeah. is jamming We for the first time in yeah, a while. So, yeah. You're like that, eh, number 89. And she takes the lead. It's really well done. The crowd yeah. loved that one yeah. here. We're having a good time. It's a poor jam because um, the um, jammer of Madrid is on the box. And the... Uh, 
standing, so we got 10 seconds or left on that jammer <laughs> penalty in the meantime. But yeah, power jam, but you know, you need to get out of the pack for that. Look at the wall. Those blockers are doing a great job, Madrid. Yeah. I don't, I, it, was a little, it was a little bit different in the game we just saw, but I think now they've, they've had it's to true. adjust to Namur. And the, the two jammer are on the, the pack. They're not going anywhere. They're, they're very struggling. Stuck in, they're stuck in the same corner. Yeah. But that means that the bro blockers are doing a great job because, you know, without blockers, no roller derby as well, even though we love watching the jammers fly by. Look at that. We're even going with a stash. Like, maybe if I take my help, nah, it's tough to. Yeah, the jammer uh, of Madrid is uh, recycling by uh, Namur blockers. Yeah, that's really, really tough times for Nenaza, but they've jammed a lot in this game too. Oh, they're there with Star, star pass. pass. No, we got a no, Star no, Pass. No, no Star Pass, I don't Yeah, think number so. 61 picked it up, so... Yeah, we've had a Star Pass. Ah, okay. You're making yeah. me doubt myself there. Okay. Hang on a I, 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 yeah. He had the Odin picked it up, number okay. 61. But we're having a good look at what's going on, and it's not really obvious, I do, I do mm. admit. But uh, that is a tactic. Uh, I have to say, uh, Namur did, uh, Auvergnac were the ones that, in fact, um, did a lot of star passes at the beginning. Yep. Uh, Namur, not so much. But Namur, people that picked it up were people like Lanroule picked up a lot of, and Bat Smash too, as well, instead of just straight up jamming. So that yep. was interesting. And we have uh, Ninon against uh, Dame Veneno. And uh, Dame Veneno takes the lead. Uh, no, there are oh, you fought. You jinxed it. <laughs> she's, we call that no. she's going to the box, box so jam. it's a power jam for Namur. Yeah, we call that the announcer's curse. We announce it and then something goes. <laughs> but it's not, of course. <laughs> Things don't really work that way. Look, we're going to speed up that pack yeah. too, and Nino's like, oh, yeah, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to get into this. And they really take the inside a lot. The inside First going pass. Yeah, perfect. Four points for Namur. Yeah, but also almost always taking the inside. You'll have to, yeah. I say that to everyone, the players can't hear, but that's where Nino seems to be able to do that. But also just tricking people and getting by. Yeah, and if it doesn't work out, it doesn't, but they're going to keep going. Oh, look at that. They had a chance to keep going too. That's perfect. Yeah, the German or not. Madrid is return. No, oh. that didn't, I wasn't oh. sure I was following it. Forgive me, the action was really fast, but. A four two, so now it's a power jam for Madrid. That's right, power yeah. jam Madrid. Or. Okay, there we go. We're going to go the whole hog now, which is uh, for two minutes. Look at that. The gym. We also got pivot. Busy yeah. box. That's a lot of penalties yeah, well, coming out. Yeah, a lot of players in the box. Yeah, that's a lot of penalties for now. So let's keep looking at the action now. Everyone's trying to position themselves pretty well. They're trying to wait to see who's going to come back to the trap. Now we've got the Fernino coming back, but now that means that Damvenena can do a lot of damage, picking up four points, that last yeah. scoring pass as well. And Ninon uh, is returning on, on, the, on the track. She's struggling uh, with the Madrid uh, wall. Another an blocker to uh, the box, too. Yeah. yeah, we keep seeing that because we hear the, the whistle and then we go, okay, what's what's going on now? See, look again, the inside, I'm telling you, the inside is, yeah. the inside has oh, cookies. And, uh, an epic <laughs> jump. <laughs> there's there's, there's Four treats points. on the inside. Four, Four points, points for both. We, uh, with the Apex jump. Yeah, 8-8 eight, eight each. Ah, Good. Yeah. yeah, so we have mm. Namur Roller Derby in front with 35 points. Uh, Namur Roller Derby à l'instant avec 35 points. Et uh, Roller Derby Madrid avec uh, 18. 18 points. 18 puntos. <laughs> J'essaie de le calculer, je me trompe pas. There we go. Des We're doing our best. Des Lo siento mucho. <laughs> <laughs> There we go. So it's a timeout. Yeah, we're going to dot some I's, cross some T's, make sure everything is being taken care of. There's a huddle in the middle. It means that everyone's talking to each other. So in the meantime, we can tell you about our sponsors, uh, yeah. Wallonie Infrastructure and La Région Wallonne. Uh, mm -hmm. They gave us a grant uh, for the to be able to organize this event. Yeah. We also have La Ville de Namur, the city of Namur, for the Tabor Hall. Uh, hire, which is an amazing hall. We're really having a great time here. And third, uh, Kralias is also a sponsor that has given us some uh, bandages and medical equipment and things yeah. that we needed to hire that the wonderful medics have as well. So we are extremely thankful uh, and grateful for our sponsors this weekend. Yeah, and uh, thanks to uh, Namur Capital because it's the first time uh, the Skate German Tournament uh, 
is in Namur. Yeah, no, you, we, we've, we had to say that about five times, yeah. right? It's the first time, fifth edition, finally yeah. in Namur. Like we said, we've been in Floref. Where else yeah. have we been? Uh, in... Um, Sorry, with an M. Oh, sorry, I put you on the spot. Somewhere else. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, uh, uh, Liège. Uh, ah, voilà. La, la région de Liège. The re oh, yeah, that's yeah, kind so of far away, actually. Yeah, yeah, far again. away. Yeah, um, it's true, yeah. 30 minutes uh, in, in car. No, that's fair enough, yeah. And yeah. so uh, this is the first time in the fifth edition that we've been here. This tournament has been held in 2017, 2018, 2019, 2022, and in 2000. Uh, and 2000, whatever today, 2024. <laughs> Sorry. And uh, fun fact, let me tell you one. Uh, two f easy fact. Vienna and Madrid have both been here uh, twice. Mm. Of course, Namur has been here the whole time. Yep. And the team that's been here from the furthest away were the Albany All Stars of yeah. New York. Albany is the capital of the state of New York, and most of the players had never been outside the US oh. and had never been in Europe. So when they found Belgian beer, they tasted it. So it was uh, they had their, their blast. first travel. It, for them, uh, it was a huge deal to come mm. all the way over here because it's not cheap. <laughs> but they were very happy to join Skate Around, so kudos to Namur okay. and the organization. So the 11 jams with uh, Gilis against uh, Paula, and uh, Paula takes the lead. Gilis is on uh, the pack. Ah, a star pass. A star yeah. pass uh, a big with L'Enroule. <laughs> yeah, there roule. we go. See, L'Enroule, we were talking roule, about star pass. takes yeah. the cover. Yeah, nicely done. So now and we've got both jammers at the same time. And, and there's a calling. Call. Yeah, because that's what you do. <laughs> mm -hmm. You kind of know that. Oh, but look, uh, Madrid's, yeah, Madrid was like, hey, yeah, I asked you to call it. It's like we can comment, we can have a look at what's going on on both sides. So that's interesting. Of course, we're closer to the Namur bench, but we have no... Uh, mm. We love everybody equally. That's all good. No one in the box for this next one. I was, f and we've got 35 to 22. Still a pretty tight game. Nobody, uh, nobody has really a big lead, and we have less than half, uh, half of this half to go. Yeah, bat, bat smash, smash yep. against uh, Nenaza, and uh, Nenaza, uh, no lead. No lead. No, nope. no, nope. for now. No. Nope. She, she's recycling. Yeah, that's uh, that's how that's going. So then that means they, that mirrors uh, the advantage. And uh, they, they uh, was a star pass. Pulp uh, takes uh, the cover. Yeah, good good call there by Pulp. Pulp coming in for uh, for some points. Hopefully, let's see how that goes. Only against three blockers gets through on the inside. Yeah, for four. Four Beautiful. points. Yeah, that's four good news. Let's have a look at uh, other walls. The walls here. Look, everyone's got to get back together again. Jammer standing, yeah, we hear that from the bench too as well. Mm. So Pulp is going to make the best of it. And the crowd's already telling us if they get through or not because they cheer, so we know that. That's mm. kind of cool. And uh, the Jammer of Madrid uh, return on the track. She's recycling by Knappi. Yeah, got recycled. Tr doing a little bit of a stash thing, but uh, mm. yeah, I mean, that's a whole lot of jamming if you count the game before, too, as well. So it's quite, quite nice to watch for, Namur, uh, for uh, Madrid. Pardon. She, uh, she makes the first pass. Yeah, finally through, not a lead, obviously. But yeah. we don't know. We could, they could still score some points. It's perfect. One more blocker down from Namur. So three against four for now. See, if you hear a bit of clapping, it's Madrid. And of course, if you hear a lot of cheering, <laughs> it's going to be for Namur. Just the way, the way it goes. But that is four points. You predicted that one nicely. And some and more. Oh, yeah. Eight points for Madrid. Oh, it's getting tighter, people. Eight and eight. Eight and eight, yeah. Those are good, happy numbers. <laughs> jam, jam off. 12 points for Namur and 8 points for Madrid for this jam. So that's a 17 point difference. That is not a lot. That no. is basically a power jam difference. Mm. Still good. But both teams now are getting used to each other. Uh, they know they know what to do. They know they know how that's going to go. And of course, uh, they're going to see each other. Well, we're going to see them differently next uh, tomorrow. But for now, we've got uh, we've got this going on. So uh, for this jam, we have Ninon against Angie. 
And ah, uh, we're gonna do that. We're gonna oh. do the I'm gonna back you up part. What the fuck? Uh, no, it's, it's really simple. They're just uh. gonna back up and they're gonna just take their time. Oh. Yeah, I know. It's fun to watch, right? Nino knows exactly what they're doing. Yeah. And then we're gonna try and no, it didn't really work out. But that's good news for Majid. Let's have a look. Okay. Angie's, so. what's that's what's going on? Let's look at the action. Angie's got it. Angie coming in for a starring, uh, for a, uh, sorry, for a scoring pass. Yeah, Nino is recycling. Yeah, Nino is being recycled, indeed. Mm. Yeah, from the back. Recycling is good, even in roller derby. It's always good. <laughs> but it is, uh, Madrid's having a, a good run of this. And, you know, you want to get into that second half with, like, a, the closest amount of points. You know, you want to do something. You could feel it. I can feel it from here. They just want to get those points ah. on the board. Angie's doing a great job. Both jammers are out. Yes, yeah, so uh, go, goes in the box. Yeah, the bench is, yeah, see the Madrid's bench, very happy, like, thanks for the call off. You'll notice too, like, Angie wasn't even looking, wasn't looking in back at what's going on. They're like, my bench is picking it up. Speaking of benches, we have uh, Namuro that's asking for a timeout. So we can tell you about more things. We can always tell you about more things. Mm -hmm. We're going to have an awards ceremony tomorrow. For anybody who's joining in, having a great time, we have an awards ceremony tomorrow. Uh, after our two first games, you need to have a look at our schedule. That'll be fun. And let's have a look at what's going on online. Uh, we have people saying, hello, Alexia. Oh. You've got a fan club. You should <laughs> yeah. be really proud of yourself. It's my family, vamos, vamos gatas. So like, go, go gatas. We get that, yeah. On donne tout Namur. Yeah, OK, of course, we got the fan. Uh, Femme of Pulp, and someone said, Coucou Pierre. Okay, bah, bonjour Pierre, whatever, <laughs> that's good too. Bonjour à vous aussi uh, sur le stream. On vous remercie, on, on fait pas le truc en espagnol, uh, ça sera un peu trop pour nous malheureusement, mm. mais on est très content uh, si vous voulez nous envoyer des messages. Surtout Alexia, Alexia a fait uh, du boulot, elle aussi ouais, a fait deux parties de fil aujourd'hui. Oui, ouais, c'est la Madrid. première fois que, que je commente un match uh, en stream. Ah, fantastique, bah, c'est bien, c'est très bien. Uh, we'll get back to it now. I hope we have. Uh, you can follow us on the stream. Be sure to like, subscribe, be nice to the stream, do everything, press all the buttons. It's going to make our crew feel really good yeah. and happy for being able to bring you this fantastic, I'm not kidding, this fantastic live stream because it ain't cheap, as we're going to tell you. So now we have Gilis uh, again, Dame Veneno, and we, are, we have a fault. Yeah, uh, we've got a four. penalty. Yeah, yeah. Four. yeah. So power jump for Namur. That's the important part. There you yeah. go. Yeah. And what a start. And Gilles str is struggling uh, in the, the Madrid world. Yeah, that's tough times. There's some penalties being called there by uh, yeah. Daniel Ririo. I recognize. And uh, when you hear a whistle, then you try and figure out what's going on. Uh, but you know what? In the meantime, um, L'Enroule is like, yeah, I don't care. I'm just going to keep going. So that's a really mm. good call. La Roule is moving everything out of the way for uh, Gilles. Yeah. Thank you for that, Gilles. Uh, and Gilles pass. Yeah. But that was tough. Look at that. It took a whole round around the track for that to happen. Yeah. And uh, Dame Veneno is, is returning in the track. So the two jammer are, are on the pack. Oh, it's a lot of whistling going on. Yeah, first scoring, po uh, first scoring pass for Gilles. For four, good, good call. Four points. Yeah, nicely. Uh, but let's have a look at the pack. The pack is very thinned out, so like all these people yeah. have to make sure they know what to do. And, and as I say scoring. that, yeah, we got a call off. So we have a look at the jam refs. They both have their fists in the air, which means that in those last scoring pass, mm. no one made any points. So again, we're not having really big, let's have a look. We're not having huge scoring passes. Now we did with, uh, I believe, bat smash at one point. Mm. Uh, we're not noting that at the moment, but we're just having a good look at it. We're collecting a few points and we're stopping. We're collecting a few points and we're stopping. However, Namur still in front with 51. Yep. Roller Derby Madrid with 38. And now we have bat smash for Namur against Paula for uh, Madrid. We're going to back it up a little yep. bit. It gave us a, for, a mini yeah, break. Yeah, for, for the blocker <laughs> to return. Yeah, there you go. You want to take the time because now we're, we're working with two less blockers. Yeah, it, but Smash uh, takes the lead. Yeah, I know. The whole the whole crowd goes wild in the meantime doing that. Star Stash on the mm. Madrid side of things for Paolo, also doing a great job today. And we're trying to empty the box. But look how fast everything is going yeah. here, Alexa. That's some serious business. 
and calling. Yeah, we got a call. We have a look. Four points then extra for Namur. But mm -hmm. it's like four points stop, four points stop. In the beginning, we had, you know, at least two scoring passes. Now we're having just one. Mm -hmm. And uh, I don't want to say people are tired because that's saying that they're not playing well or not. But we are like two games in for everybody. And it's, uh, it's later during the day, so it may be a bit different. I just want to know where we're going to end up at the end of the first half because that's going to kind of give us an idea of uh, what kind of discussion is going to happen between the teams uh, when they come back to the yeah. track for the second. And now for Vidjam, we have uh, Ninon against uh, Nenaza for Madrid. The, the two jammers are, are on the pack. And Ninon take the lead. Yeah, Madrid made it difficult there. I, was, I saw some nice blocking from yeah. our angle that we had. Yeah. Star Stash for Madrid. Yeah. Oh, you know, trying on the outside for a change. I'm saying ah, that because yes. the inside has been everyone's favorite today. I don't know why. Mm. Just one of those things. But Madrid is really doing some great blocking at the moment. So is Namur in the back, though. They want to frustrate Madrid. And let's just say sometimes there's a little bit of a flustering going on on the Madrid side that we've seen that. Then again, easy to say it's their second game in the road, too, as well. Yeah. Look at that. Look how we're running down this clock. Not, we're standing still. That's some excellent blocking. Mm. La Stadel de Namur. <laughs> no, no. That joke. That joke's not working this week. I'm gonna retire. Le mur de Namur. Le mur de Namur. Yeah, I, I tried to. The Berlin Wall is a classic. You, yeah. If you can put that when your derby career is, is perfect. Great work by Nino. For four. Yeah. So Nino is on the and uh, second uh, scoring pass for Nino. So eight point for uh, Namur and zero point for uh, Madrid. Yeah, that's the way it's going to go for now. So we've got five, a little less than six minutes left here in the first half. The teams are close, but not that close. Yeah. However, very different than what we've seen so far. And uh, we're noting all of this as well. Again, uh, Namur won their first game. Madrid won their first game. Mm. That's interesting. So who's yeah. going to win this game? And we have uh, <laughs> Gilles against uh, Dame Veneno. And uh, Dame Veneno takes the lead. Yeah, oh, oh, that's some, a lot of hits going on there. Yeah. On the other side of things, that's uh, Chaton, number 13. Yeah, it's a star pass, Chaton, uh, Chaton has the cover. I know, I got that. I tried to, yeah, yeah has the cover. Uh, still needs to get through the back, though. <laughs> You're absolutely mm. right. But that's tough. Look, look, look. Yeah, I figured as much. They came in the front of the wrong player. Uh, so they're power jam for Madrid. Yeah, power jam for Madrid, indeed, yeah. Power jam for Madrid. Madrid recycling all in the back. We keep moving back away from us. <laughs> I want them to move forward. No, it's all fine, actually. That just means that we're some great play there. Namur is slowing that down. That's really good. Uh, Madrid trying to cause some chaos there, but it's a bit difficult because they can't really, they're not really forming a wall. Yeah. Oh, there we go. Oh. Then it gets through. Beautiful. Yeah, they're doing a great job for four. But let's have a look at the pack now, simply because we want to look, everyone's coming back at the same time. That's what I figured as well. And that star pass is still happening. Yeah. It's not finished. Still in progress. Look at that, Chateau uh, on the outside. Yeah, it's exciting. Very, very strong wall uh, by Madrid. I know, I'm telling yeah. you, look at, look at how they're digging in. The, yeah. They're just digging in. They've got the energy to do that. And it's very well practiced. Chateau has not been able to get through for a while now in, in um, I can't say just in this jam, uh, but, but yeah. look, everyone's happy, it happens. Yeah, she passed. In the meantime, they've got a power jam because uh, the Madrid jammer went to mm. the box. Ah, uh, yeah, it's true. Can you believe this? Yeah, this is uh, power business. jam with a pivot. With pivot. A pivot. Oh, pivot. Oh, pivot yeah. turn jammer. Yeah, pivot and jammer. They're jammer now. <laughs> <laughs> You change uh, automatically. But we still got a while to run down this clock. Oh, no. I meant running down the, okay. the period clock because obviously this is over. But look, both teams scored points. Yeah. That was a really complicated jam. You had fun watching that, right? Did you have yeah. fun watching that? Yeah. You got excited. Fun. Yeah, it is a lot of fun. Yeah. But it's complicated to follow the action. It's actually it's actually quite a bit. Easy announcer math, 20-point difference at the minute. Mm. Uh, Namur in front and uh, Madrid in the back. We have uh, Min on the track. Uh, she is a blocker of Namur, and uh, it's uh, her first uh, skate around tournament oh. because uh, she just uh, rejoined the, the Namur uh, 8. Well, then that's really cool to be able to, to play again like that. Good, yeah. good on her. That's really nice. That's good news. 
And for now, uh, L'Enroule is trying to get, uh, find the footing, as they say, uh, trying to find a way in. And uh, is again up against that serious uh, Madrid wall. Madrid yeah. picks up the lead in the meantime, but let's have a look at what's going on with Namir, just because, uh, I don't know, Madrid have found a way to stop, uh, stop Namir from getting around somewhere. Oh. Look at that. Apex jump uh, by uh, Madrid, number Madrid's getting, getting a bit anxious. But you know what? Madrid knows that they only need to do a few more rounds to bring the score up. Yeah. Star, pass star pass completed. Yeah. For uh, bat smash. So, uh, and uh, Madrid uh, is calling. They're calling and they're going, Hello? <laughs> 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 Bonjour. Uh, yeah, we're going to adjust those points. Look at that. Not too big of a difference. 16 points, still, still, yeah. uh, you can still bridge that gap uh, later on. It's not a lot. No, but it's not, it's, uh, it's kind of nice to see too as well. Mm. We have our friend, uh, colleague Arno here in the, in the hall, uh, telling everyone what's going on from the edge. We've got a so nice little team going too this weekend. Mm. Let's get back on track, uh, Nino and uh, Paola. Paola. And the... Uh, the, the two jammers are very close uh, each other, but uh, Ninon takes the lead and Paola and Ninon call. C'est fi fini. <laughs> yeah. End of the jam. Fini, yeah. It's, uh, you, know, you get in front, you know the other one's in back, call off. Mind you, mind you, there are games uh, and there are situations where they run it long, what we call, mm. where they just go, you know what, we'll just go and try and score as many points as we can. And the goal then, of course, is to score, it's going to sound, uh, score, more points faster, yeah. but especially faster than the other team. So, yeah. so we've had a lot of penalties. We might we might want to have a look at that maybe a little bit later. Mm. But for now, and now Gilles we have uh, Gilles against uh, Nenaza for Madrid. The two jammers are uh, on the pack. No lead uh, for the moment, and Nen Nenaza take the lead for Madrid. That's good news. Star stash uh, from Namur. And star pass. L'enroule uh, takes the cover. Good news. Nina's are coming in for a scoring pass. Yes, trying to get some. Oh, yeah. And there's the jam. Yeah, that was. Uh, I, I enjoyed that. I saw Chaton was just waiting for that jammer going, oh, I'm going to get you. Mm. That was tough. And we're going to have uh, an official review that's ah. being requested. Yeah. Official review, because I heard it was finished, it's not. There's an official no. review first. No, it's Being requested finished. by uh, Namur, if I'm not mistaken. Um, Can you see? Yeah, yeah, yeah I think okay, so, because uh, Ili, uh, the coach of Namur, voilà. uh, is uh, with the officials. We'll, uh, we'll, we'll have a look at what's going on. I have to say, yeah. this is fun. Ili had uh, called a first official review of the um, day earlier on today and mm. actually won it. That yes, doesn't it happen all the time. Mm. And again, uh, it was for a jammer penalty because that's often, that, often what happens. Mm -mm. Or to have something removed. But we'll see how that goes. Uh, Ili also very experienced. You know her quite yeah, well. She Ili helps organize the tournament. She well. is uh, one of the players who formed the, the Namur Roller Derby League. Yeah, yeah. yeah I know. They're, they're, they're always mm -hmm. here. So, yeah, it's good. They always help out a lot too with, uh, yeah. You guys have a lot of players. Yeah. So still, Numbers always had a lot of players. Every every region yeah. has a different uh, different are, situation. Yeah, yeah, there are three uh, feminine uh, teams on Namur and uh, one uh, masculine team. Yeah, that's a lot. Yeah, that's mm. a lot. Yeah. Wonderful. Ili's gonna wait for for the thing. We still have a few seconds on the clock for this one, but yeah, this is the time where you need to pick your battles, which means, in this case, the official review. I think uh, arbitrage officiel, there's a fancy word for that in French, but even I'm forgetting it today, so. Yeah. Yeah. And that's what I mean by having a look at what's going on. Uh, let me have a, re a quick repeat. Uh, tomorrow we're going to get started at 10 a.m., so a bit earlier. 10 a.m., we're going to have L'Auvergnac uh, Roller Derby play in Madrid. By then, everyone will have had, uh, had a break. And then we're also going to have uh, Namur mm -hmm. Roller Derby playing Vienna. So we're going to see... Uh, we're going to see teams that haven't played each other uh, before. Mm -hmm. And, of course, don't go away at the end of the day. We will have an award ceremony in the middle of the day, which is, uh, which is unique. I kind of like it. And we're going to have uh, some local teams play as well. So there's going to be roller derby going on 
uh, until at least uh, dinner time tomorrow. So please, uh, please be around. And for anyone who's on the stream right now, feel free to like, subscribe, say beautiful things. All those hearts, plus de cœur, lots of hearts, corazones, whatever, just send them. And know that the streaming team has, how should I say, worked themselves into a frenzy to make sure that you can get the stream going on. So But NG uh, against Nino and the NG uh, for Madrid takes the lead. Uh, Nino has uh, the cover in, uh, in her head. And uh, it's a star pass for uh, Batmash. Batmash uh, takes the cover. Again? Yeah. <laughs> and a call but, off. But call off. We're not allowed to announce it, what happens, but we expect it very often too. And so right, right now, the ends, you're going to tell us about the ends? Yeah, it's uh, the intermission. And uh, now we have uh, um, 66.4 for Namur and uh, 54 points for Madrid. And we've got uh, about 14 minutes, so go do what you need to do there. And uh, on va le dire en français, on va remercier tout le monde uh, de nous regarder. On remercie tout le monde de nous écouter aussi. On fait de notre mieux. Et puis, euh, on a beaucoup plus de roller derby pour vous aujourd'hui. Euh, on va avoir euh, plus tard aujourd'hui encore euh, Vienne, qui, Vienne, Vienne à roller derby qui vont jouer contre des Auvergnacs. Mm -hmm. Ça va être super intéressant. Alors, allez chercher votre, ce que je dis toujours, votre breuvage préféré. Oui, un thé, puis, un café. Oui, <rire> moi, j'essaie de pas de décider lequel. Et puis, on va revenir. We'll be back to you in a bit. So, uh, hasta luego or something. <laughs> Adios. Ad Adios. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> okay. A tout. We're back. We still have two more minutes now before we continue on with our wonderful, tight enough game between Namur Roller Derby A and uh, Madrid Roller Derby. So, Alexa, how, uh, how are you feeling about this game? Uh, it's, a, it's a very beautiful game. Uh, it's fun. I, I like to uh, watch it. You're enjoying watching yeah, it too yeah, as well. Yeah. You know everybody really well too, so mm -hmm. that's good. You watch yeah. Madrid play, as we said uh, many times, we'll keep repeating it. We have Namur playing their second game of the day and uh, Madrid playing their second game of the day. So that's interesting as well. Mm. Madrid Roller Derby were part of this tournament, obviously, this time around. And also, let me have a good look at my uh, information just to be sure. They've been here before, I believe it was in 2000 and... Where is it again? 2017, they were here, if I'm yeah. not mistaken. Yeah, it Madrid is. There you go. Can't read my own handwriting. Yeah. 2017, yeah, way back in the day, that was quite interesting. Mm. And uh, we've had different teams over the years, too, but there's teams that always seem to really enjoy coming back. And uh, Vienna is also one of them, so that's kind of cool. Kind of far to come here, but that's, uh, that's the way it is with roller derby, moving around a lot. So. Mm. And uh, it's uh, the first uh, game of the day with um, a score very close. Yes, it's the closest we've had. Mm. Uh, you've so far had a chance. Uh, Roller Derby Madrid, actually, as well. Uh, let's let's explain it more that way. Have had the highest score of the day so far with their last game, but we have no. This could go in all which directions. 20 more seconds to go, and what I'm thinking, I'm thinking, okay, Madrid's going. Listen, we're a little bit in the back, but we need to find a way to get back in front. So that's the story we're going to follow. And of course, Namir's story is uh, we need more points in the front to make sure that uh, Madrid stays uh, stays in our uh, rear view mirror. Comme dans le rétroviseur. Ah oui, OK. OK, sorry, that was a, <laughs> I, that was a deep cut there. Sorry about that. <laughs> I'm not very nice to you today, so I'm doing my best. But <laughs> problem. Thank you very much for everyone who's watching. Yeah, Bam Bam Namur, Ali Namur, we've got a lot of uh, Namur fans, but hey, if you're from Madrid fan, feel free to let us know there on the stream. So yeah, tell me what's going on. First jam of the period with um, Ninon uh, for Namur and Nenaza for uh, Madrid. Nenaza takes the lead. And uh, we have uh, a star pass, uh, Pulp uh, takes take the cover. How long is that going to last though? Let's have a look coming in. Oh, and, and there we go. Fall off. <laughs> I laugh because I'm, I'm happy to see this. There was a time where it was more difficult not to see this. But you've ex experienced seeing this as a, as a skater as well. So yeah, I, I was a skater for Namur, for Les Parpins. De ah, Les Parpins, of yeah, course. The yeah. B team of Namur. So you, did you ever play a, a skater on? Because I do believe Les Parpins played uh, back in 2019. Was uh, it before no, your time? I, I uh, began to play in um, 2022. Uh, Okay, so yeah. later on, but Les, les Parpins had played uh, way mm. back in the way back in the day, back when back before the pandemic. 
I'm so happy to be back on track. And that's good news then for uh, Gillis. Yeah, Gillis uh, takes the lead. For Namur, 27. For Namur. Yep. And uh, we have uh, a star pass. Another the number uh, 61 of uh, Madrid uh, takes the cover. But power jam. Yeah, power jam because uh, Gillis is on the box. That's pretty. So then you don't get that you don't get that thing called off on uh, on your face. So that's actually a good thing. So that's number 61 doing the rounds right now for M Madrid. That's Hija de Odin, the daughter of Odin, if you were going to translate it, but it doesn't matter. Hija de Odin. That's good news. Yeah. Oh, look at that, getting through the inside She's on the best. tippy toes. Four points for Madrid. But look at that score, like she has getting you excited. I'm telling you, Madrid's like, it's our turn to do stuff. Mm. And this is when you don't want to be in the box as the other team, because yeah. it's going to heat it up on both sides. And Gilles is returning on the track. Yeah, uh, in the back though, Namur, and Namur's mm. wall breaking up, so that's good news for Namur. But everyone's all jammed up in a corner. Yeah. We can't really see what's going on so much. There we go, red jammer coming through. Second scoring pass for Madrid. And what does that mean? What does that mean, Alexia? It will mean eight points for Madrid. No, it means something else. It means that Madrid's in front now. Ah, but yeah. only by one ah, point. Yeah, true. Yeah, I know. 67, cool? 66. Yeah, we call And that a, we it's a, power a lead jam. change. Yeah. And more power jumps. Power uh, jump, yes. Uh, that's too many the power jumps. Yeah. Again. That's not Again. Good. Okay, so that means we may we're we're not wishing for anyone to drop out of the game, but this is a, quite a lot of. Uh, of uh, penalties for now. We'll try to have a look at that later. We mm. hadn't ever had a chance, but you'll, we'll keep you posted. Oh, this is a great jam for Madrid. Yeah, end of the jam, so. Uh, 11 points for Madrid and four points for Namur at this jam. So, the score is 70-70 for the both teams. We're having a quick look there. Yeah. Sorry, uh, fun th fun things going on on your screen, but the important part is points. So we've got a, we're even again. Yeah, even again. Even again. So close. You're like this, eh? Yeah. This is fun. Madrid did a great job, had an 11-point jam on that last one, so that was good. Mm. The public is on fire. Yeah, they're having a great <laughs> time. We're really happy. Friends and families coming here, supporting uh, their favorite team, obviously, probably Namur. Uh, hey, you know, fun facts, too. Just for the hell of it, I'll tell you, we're next to Expo Namur, and there's a whole bunch of people uh, dressed as Vikings there, having a ah, medieval yeah. something. It's fun. <laughs> I thought, oh, these people look cool. They must be rolled. Oh, no, they're not. I thought it was really funny. We're in a really great part of uh, town uh, with a lot of things going yeah, on Yeah, we have uh, some uh, plastic axe. And yeah, and the plastic axe. Yeah, you like, like those, that. Right? I'm gonna buy you one. Very funny. I'm gonna buy you one. I think you liked it too. <laughs> I saw a guy with a beard, like a fake beard, talking to me, and I just thought, oh, okay, yeah, it's just a normal morning in the in the mirror. Quite funny. We're having a discussion. Uh, we're gonna get back started again. Uh, sometimes we just need to set things up properly. And now we're now we're getting to the part called serious business because yeah. we have both uh, going on. The third jam of the, the second period, and we have uh, Gilles. Uh, against Paula, Paula for Madrid, Gilles for Namur. Re recycle, and uh, the two jammers are on the pack for the moment, no lead, and Gilles takes the lead, but uh, no, Paula uh, rests in the pack, star stash, she, she has uh, the cover on uh, his hand, on yeah, her sure. hand. The cover is on in any case, but look, yeah. we're indicating a bit of a and the pass, star on, pass the other, on the yeah. other side. Yeah, star pass, uh, so many star passes. The, my, my, yeah, my. true. The number uh, 86 to take the cover. Yeah, that's true. 86 Madrid, that's Hawaii. 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 I can get behind a name like that. It makes me want to have a certain kind of vacation. <laughs> <laughs> Great name. I'm happy to name few. But now we've got someone who's getting yelled at. But yelled at's maybe an exaggeration. Now one blocker uh, down for Madrid. One blocker in the box. Yeah. A lot of penalties so far, but yeah, we keep saying mm. that. And tough times getting out of the pack, whoever you are. And yeah. a whole lot of ah. whistling going. Oh, yeah. A mini apex jump. Yeah, Q4 four points for Gilles, first scoring uh, pass. That was really good, yeah. And yeah, about time, four points. 
Paula tr even trying to get in there as yeah, a blocker? Yeah, she's struggling in the wall, in the Namur wall. Yeah, that's tough times. And uh, yeah, and still quite a bit of people in the box. Knappy is in the box. Blocker yeah. for Namur. Stretching out that pack. And just getting through four for four. points for Gilles. Eight points at this moment. Yeah. Well, let's have a look at what's going on in the pack. In the meantime, everyone's going, oh, what am I going to do? Frustration there. I can I can totally understand for Paula visiting the box too as well as a blocker. Yeah. But you can you could just tell, like, what did I do now kind of thing. Frustration can definitely play a, a role a bit in the future. No points on that last scoring pass for Madrid. And mm. a total of... 12. Oh, nice. 12 points. So we went from 70 to 82. Both very good years, by the way. Yeah. yeah. I'm not that old, but 82 I can get behind. 82 I can get behind. It's a good year. Starting back up again. And now, like, Madrid's like, hang on a second. We were able to do it. Namur ran away with it again. Yeah, we have Ninon uh, against Nenaza again. Again? Yeah. Yeah, so the both benches have figured that and out. And Ninon uh, takes the lead very quickly. That's Stash. a stash. Stash, yeah. Yeah. Just trying to trick the uh, opponents, Nenaza, we saw a lot from. First scoring points uh, for Ninon and Kolov. So, four points for Namur. Yeah, Namur jumping up in front, but we had that moment where Madrid was getting in there. And you know what we're going to see is we're going to see people changing up the jammer rotation to try and match it up maybe a bit differently. Mm. But you know everyone needs to stay out of the box. We've got one, one, two people in the box on the Madrid side. Yeah. Yeah. Two blocker uh, of Madrid in the box. Yeah, and being two on... Oh, then we're going to get... I see 40-40 already getting in there. Pimous to try and uh, yeah. make a mess we of Madrid. We have a long rule uh, with jam. We jump for uh, Namur and uh, uh, Dame Veneno for Madrid. Yeah, we got that going on. Yeah, I'm having take the lead. Good one through the inside with a stash. No lead though for Madrid, but Madrid no. is out. Madrid is out. That's what counts. Yeah. Lanroul is getting the business from uh, from Madrid. Oh, that oh. was real business. See, that was serious business there on the uh, side. Yeah. Okay, that was a bit of knockout. Everything's okay. Charton was like, yeah, it's cool. We're happy, but we're going to have a team timeout uh, for the moment. Team timeout, Madrid. Uh, easy announcer math. We've got 20 point difference. Yeah, uh, and then we're having a great time of it. That's The outcome of this game, though, is going to give us a quite more information for uh, obviously the ranking for the ranking of this tournament for, for tomorrow too as well. I'm mm. uh, looking forward to that. Again, I remind you we have one more game today at 6.15. We're going to have game four. We're going to have Vienna against Auvergne. Yeah, and then we'll have... Uh, I'll still be here chatting away apparently. Yeah. And I'm going to be With joined Dark by Pistol. a friend. Yeah, I know, by Dark Pistol. Mm. And we'll have our very own toxic lady who's been helping us uh, organize this tournament for the announcers telling people in the hall all about it. And I think, yeah, it's kind of like there's going to be more people showing up just because it's late in the day and it's kind of nice to do. So we had an interesting half. Oh, yeah, our halftime was uh, 70, no, 63-70 when we had that. Yes. Yeah. I was trying to take note of that, 63-70. Need to take note of that the third game. And for now, yeah, and still now got a while to go. Let's have a look. Okay, and now uh, we have Ninon, uh, who jumped for Namur, with uh, Nenaza for Madrid. Ah, and uh, Nenaza uh, is going on the box, so it's a power jump for Namur. More box time, that's not good. Yeah. yeah. Lead for uh, Ninon. Oh, inside, and outside. First scoring pass. Yeah, that's very, that was some very good uh, getting through there. Ninon just keeps on going too, very calm. I really yeah. like the jammer, very calm, very kind of having a look at where they can already go by the time they hit the pack. It's really nice to watch. In Namur, uh, we called uh, um, a Ninon a jam when uh, we make a lot of points. It's a Ninon. 
Oh wow! <laughs> yeah. Oh man, that's that's it's a neat, that's really nice. That's what a compliment. What a compliment. Yeah, but you know that's concentration. People are really just good at the doing all the jamming thing. I just like making people feels like difficult. That was fun. Uh, Star Stash and Inaza is out of mm. the pack too because that's what you just wanted. You want to get out, and they've been playing solid uh, all weekend so far. It's fantastic. Yeah, Nino uh, is going on the box, so now it's a poor jam for Madrid. Power jam Madrid. It's like my our colleague said, "Sapas," which means you get through, mm. and it's all going to get through. Oh, we're trying to get C three nine four. Uh is getting into it. That was kind of nice to watch. And now we're going to recycle and back up. Yeah, and a uh, uh, fault for uh, a blocker of Namur. Yeah, a penalty for Namur. A penalty. Yeah, and that's going to be one down. But we're hearing the penalty. Like, as soon as you hear a whistle, you know something's going to happen, pretty much. And speaking of which, we're the announcer. There we go. That's one more for Madrid. That's a lot of penalties. <laughs> yeah, keep you know, he's it. returning in the track. Yeah. Madrid couldn't keep, keep them down. Yeah. Oh, look, and they picked up those points just before the yeah. jam was called off. That's Yeah, you like that, too. <laughs> I know when you go, yeah. <laughs> but that's okay. I mean, we're, we, we watch because we really like watching. We really enjoy the game, too. Uh, I, don't, I think eight's just a magic number this weekend for whatever reason. We've got 98 mm. to 78, so Namur up in front, and eight points apiece. So we're, we're getting more points per jam. Uh, and Namur uh, is, wants to keep that lead then, uh, in front for as long as they can. So now we have um, Gilles against Dame Veneno. The two jammers are on the pack. Gilles is struggling with the uh, Madrid walls, very uh, strong wall. Yeah, very much uh, on the outset. Yeah, they like yeah. that. Yeah. But yeah, you'll see Namur has like floating uh, blocker trying to get in there instead of yeah. instead of breaking up the wall. They're going to go break up the wall now, but they were more busy catching the jammer at the moment. So they're they're, they're mixing the offense and defense, like you said, yeah, is true. their specialty quite a lot. Mixing them up. Uh, oh, beautiful apex jump for uh, the number 92 of Madrid, Dan yeah. Veneno. Veneno again. Yeah. So four points uh, for uh, Madrid. A, a second apex jump from they're motivated, uh, Dame Veneno. Veneno. And yeah. they're motivated because their points are coming back up. Yeah. Okay, we're going to go for three. We're going to go for three. Let's go for three. Let's have a watch. A star of and pass. did we go for three? Yeah, yeah. we did. Look wow. at that. Three. Oh, wow. That was beautiful to watch. Yes. And they were excited. Three apex jump on it was all one for you. jump. Right all in front. All in front, too. That was a yeah. great call. <laughs> Oh, wow. This unexpected, but like you can just see them trying to get in there. Now we have only an eight point difference. Mm. 12 point jam, that is the biggest jam we've had so far, if I'm not mistaken. Mm. Uh, without counting it, but we've been watching it, so that's great. Ah. We're going to have a official timeout indicated to us by the lovely Pussy Panzerfaust from France. We recognize, you recognize a lot of people here. There's people from France, there's people from the UK, there's yeah. people from Denmark as well, uh, from uh, yeah, the Germany, official, uh, the Netherlands. Obviously are from uh, e everywhere in Europe. It's fun, eh? Yeah. Yeah, Europe is fun that way. It's always uh, always very enjoyable. We're off to the race again with L'Enroule et Angie. And uh, Angie takes the lead. Star Stash uh, by L'Enroule. First uh, scoring pass uh, for NG. L'Enroule uh, is uh, being uh, recycled by uh, the Madrid blockers. And we haven't, we're, st we're all stuck in one corner again, too, as well. Yeah. We're having a good look at the outside as far as the outside pack refs are concerned. And we're going to move back. We're going back in time there. Yeah, the Tough number for Angie. I'd see one of uh, Angie is uh, is being recycling too, recycled too. Yeah, and uh, yeah, leader for Angie by the way. Yeah, absolutely, absolutely. Uh, star pass, star pass for uh, Bat Smash. Yeah, you put it on, they call it off. Yeah, <laughs> you put it on, they call it off. Four point difference. Oh, I'm gonna get excited. E too. Every Our time. Are, yeah, yeah, look at that. Four points. And now I get to say it three times. It's my personal rule. I'm going to say it for the second time. It's anybody's game now. Mm -hmm. However, Namur have been stronger. That is a fact. But 
we're coming down to the second half. People are maybe a bit more weary, tired, maybe not the right word sometimes. And uh, you want to give that extra push, but 17 minutes is still quite a loyalist to go. Nino and Paula. Nino against Paula, yeah. Wow, uh, Pulp um, um, a sorti uh, took Paula out. du... Yeah. It took out. Yeah. Ta took out uh, Paula uh, of the track. A sorti, très bien sorti, oui. Yeah. You just, yeah, that's absolutely right. It's, uh, it was a good take out. Hit. You can say that they hit. They were hit. Hit, yeah. But we can hear the thump too. That's interesting. So you noticed it. Is Nino going to pull a Nino? Yeah, Nino, Nino has the lead. Yep. And uh, she's on the Madrid wall. Yeah, getting recycled though, so that's good work for Madrid. Madrid is out. See, that's interesting. Paula is out. Is out. They went with a stash. They're going to come back in for scoring. Pat Nino was just waiting for it with that nice, that nice little call off. Everyone, mm. has, everyone has these different types of calling off. Yeah, it's really it's cute. It's true. Yeah, but you need to make sure, and you know this, but I'm going to say it anyway, Star. You need to make sure that. Even if you don't use many movements that your that your jam ref sees it because that could cost you a few seconds and you don't want that. Mm. Number roller derby over the 100 mark with 102 after picking up four points. Roller derby Madrid not far behind and we also have a team timeout. Team timeout for Namur, which means we can uh, talk to you about mm. different things going on today. And apparently, for the medals and the awards that we're going to be, wa we're going to have a good look at tomorrow. Uh, apparently, um, uh, Cuddy Shark, a skater from uh, yeah, David the, Papa. the, the Gloria Bastards. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, we're going to watch them later on today, uh, l later on tomorrow. Sorry, mm. he designed the awards himself. He added his talents to this year's medal, so he put his uh, heart and soul into it. It's a beautiful piece of handiwork that will allow the teams to take home a souvenir of the weekend. Um, so far, you know, we've we've been given, we'll share this with you, a little pin and some stickers and even a beautiful bottle of beer <laughs> uh, brewed with a logo and everything. And Namur, yeah. Namur, Skate Around has always done that. I mean, we've done that. They've done that as well with uh, merch. Uh, some great stuff here. I mean, I realize you're at home, but Namur does merch really well. That's uh, We've been well treated and that's, that's really a lot of fun to see that kind of... Uh, enthusiasm being put in uh, different items that we're going to want to keep and go, hey, remember that fun tournament we did back in 2024? Mm. Do you know what I mean? When you get older, you'll appreciate these yeah, the, the stickers are, are made by uh, Malo. Who is Malo, a, okay. And uh, she, she, um, she's an official of, uh, in the tournament. There you go. You know everybody here. That's <laughs> perfect. How about we have a look at what's going on? Gilles and Nenaza again going head to head. Yeah, and um, the the two jammers are on the pack, struggling uh, in the walls. Yeah, walls are not a good place to be. <laughs> a blocker of Madrid will turn on the track, and Gilles takes the lead. And here we've got. Uh, yeah, some great work there by Nenaza trying to get out in the front, but they're always doing... Namir is the one doing all the blocking now. Look, the frustration is there. I was saying they're doing good, but they're just like, yeah, you need to get out there. We can, we can see it now because we've got the Madrid bench close to us. They're saying, like, take it easy, try and get through. And uh, Bat Smash and Friends is doing a great job of blocking. Yeah. Oh, and they're going to get a cutting the track. Is that a power jump for... Are we going to get a... Oh, it is. Yeah. Oh, power, power jam, jam Namur. Namur. Ooh la la. Mm. Ooh la la. Gillis so is out. Yeah, first scoring point uh, pass for Gillis. So uh, four points for Namur. Also taking their time. Eh? That was uh, that was like, uh, you know, trying to compose themselves and make sure they can get through. Bit of chaos there in the pack. Madrid trying to get in all the business. No, they finally got there in the front. And Kolov. Good wallage there for from Madrid, as it has to be said. Yeah, so the, the next uh, jam uh, will be with uh, Power Jam for Namur. That's going to be interesting. Mm. 14 uh, minutes uh, left in the second half of the third game of the fifth edition of Skate Around Tournament. Yeah, fifth edition and the first in Namur. 
I know we're going to keep saying that all weekend. <laughs> you can say that every time. In the first one in Namur, about time. <laughs> Fifth time's the charm, as we're going to say in English, instead of third time. This yeah. So now it's Ninon against Nenaza. Nenaza just seems to be on track the whole time. <laughs> yeah. Ninon as well, to be honest. Yeah, there you go. And out in front, one penalty, one person down. Oh! Uh, long one. on the box. So no no star passes for a while. Mm, yeah, no star pass possible because the pivot is on the box. Yeah, pivot is, is gone. And uh, Nenaza takes the lead. Very well done, too tough, but very well done. And look at all the, the blockers getting into each other's face there. That's yeah. fantastic. Yeah, I mean, you want to hate the blockers, but you know they're doing well. That was, we just had a bit of a hit, we're, and yeah. we're going to call off that jam. Uh, Ninaza took a hit and lost the cover from the hit, but they're okay mm. in the sense that they're up. But the jam was called off. I believe that's the first time that's happened in uh, this tournament. We're all good, people. We're all good. It's important. So let's have a look at some messages. Go Madrid and go Gatas from some lovely people who are taking on for Madrid. Well, you should be happy, Madrid. They're doing really, really well. It's all very uh, bueno over here. Um, et pour les gens de, de Namur, eh bien, continuez à nous envoyer des messages. Vous pouvez dire des, 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 des jolies choses au sujet de Alexa et moi, Nasty Moves. <laughs> Feel free to say hello. Be sure to like and subscribe and all of the things on YouTube to make sure we can continue to bring not only yeah. not only this uh, stream, but you know, we're going to continue to use uh, Derby live stream as well in the future. So please do. Uh, life is short and uh, we need all the help we can get. How's that for you? How are you doing? We got uh, for the streaming, in fact, let's talk about that. Derby live stream, we've got Doppler Refect, former coach, A-team, and Ely as well, the current coach, like you said. Mm. We've got uh, Pluska for the artwork. It's the fifth edition. And, of course, uh, Derby, dive, uh, Derby live stream is doing their best to make sure uh, they can bring you this live stream. It is, it is absolutely a pleasure to see the team working alongside Namur, Oler Derby, to bring you the quality stream at home, too. Because, believe you me, it looks really easy. It's not. It's a lot of stress and a lot of uh, time and money. And so thank you very much. If you want to support their huge work, please subscribe, as I said, to the YouTube channel through the link at youtube.com. And then you look for Derby Live Stream. It would also be, the link will also be displayed on your screen between games. So we're happy to see you. Ali Namur, yeah, so it's either Gogatas or Ali Namur. I think it's, uh, yeah. yeah, but uh, the, the people in Madrid are watching the stream. I realize they're far away too, they can't. But it's really nice to see people enjoying uh, watching these streams. I always, when I watch roller derby at home, I was always feeling like I was watching something special because a lot of my friends had no clue what I was watching. Yeah, and same. I was just getting so excited watching these games. <laughs> you too, yeah? yeah. And you'd be like, uh, World Cup in the middle of the night uh, watching yeah. Canada in 2011, I think it was. And we're just going, eh, we're going, and then we recognize Europeans and we'd be like, oh my God, that's that's so and so from this team. And no one understood, but we understood ourselves. We knew how much fun we were having watching. Yeah. And that it was free. That's very important to us too. Or accessible. Let's call it accessible. Some streams aren't free, uh, but uh, we, they try and make it uh, not too expensive. Okay. That was a long one. We're going to get back on track with you. And we have uh, Ninon against Dame Veneno. And Dame Veneno takes the league very quickly. It's a power jump for Madrid because uh, Ninon is on the box. First scoring pass for uh, Dame Veneno. So four points for Madrid. The pack is just waiting for it. And yeah. look at all the people trying to get out of the box at the same time, because they're all going to come in quite quickly at yeah. the same time. Ninon is going to return uh, on the track. And first uh, pass for uh, Ninon. Yeah, Madrid up in the front, though. And Madrid new now has to decide what they're going to do. They're going to go and call off. Yeah, but did they get anything? Did they get anything? Mm. Uh, we're going to check because they tried. They really tried to get in there. Not safe for work is talking to Daniel Ririo. Yeah. They're one point. One uh, point, yeah. Punto. The, the official uh, uh, was um, going to talk yeah. each other. Yeah, I both know, I know them, so I mentioned them by name. I'm happy to see them here too as well. And get started again. People making noise. Four-point difference, though. We're going to keep saying yeah. that because we just find out. Paula and Gillis 
Para against Gillis, and uh, the two blockers are, are on the pack. Uh, one blocker of Madrid is going on the box. And Madrid, uh, Paula of Madrid takes the lead. And the pivot uh, of um, Namur is going on the box, so uh, no uh, star pass uh, possible at, at the moment for Namur. And the first scoring uh, pass for Paula, so four, four points for uh, Madrid. And what's happening on the scoreboard, Alexa? And uh, it's an equal. We're back. Yeah, in. yeah. <laughs> I wanted to surprise you. I was like, oh, it's equal. <laughs> when, so you've yes. had it three times. Maybe you're the lucky charm going around all these games. Oh, mon mon mon. That's pretty serious stuff. It's even again. It's it's even, and it's uh, it's uh, it means that. We have no idea this is no. This is the most exciting game we've had all weekend so far. Yeah. That's pretty exciting. There you go. I like this. And let's have a reminder that at halftime we were 70 for Namur, I believe, and 63 for Madrid. And look at look where we got to now. Isn't that amazing? Yeah. So halftime sometimes gives you a good idea of how that's gonna go between the teams, but not in this case. So mm -hmm. that's a rule that should be thrown out of the window. 10 minutes left and 20, 20 minutes and 24 seconds. Yeah. In chain. 10 nice minutes chain. Uh, left and we don't know who, who is going to win uh, we this game. We never do. Yeah. We never do. We never do. There's no multiverse, although sometimes you wonder if there was. So we got, uh, we just have Go Madrid and uh, Go. We got more Madrid fans online. Vamos got show boulette. Uh, show boulette, yeah. I know that expression. I learned that from, <laughs> I learned that from Namur with the boulettes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. In German, it's also called a boulette, but it has a different. <laughs> they call the 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 meat the boulette, right? show boulette. Yeah. I know that one. Yeah, I it's also learned slogan uh, for slogan. Uh, for Namur. In the, Namur, show boulette. Un, yeah. un chant um, un chant de supporter. Oh, show boulette. Yeah. yeah. How about uh, il est comment le beurre? And people answer salé. How's the ah, butter? Ah, ça je connais pas. Ah, okay. Well, I don't know. Fair enough. <laughs> Nino, Angie. Yeah. For is your, your your jammers at the moment on the track? Yeah, the two on the pack. We have a lead though. Look at that. But the ah, lead yeah. with some recycling. Have a look at the and jammer. Yeah, yeah. and she uh, has the lead, but uh, she's being uh, recycled. Ah, uh, being recycled. Nino and, is uh, out. Yeah, Nino. Uh, and so she she cut off. Got a call out here for Iron D Doll, who's also on the track today. That's good news too. And they are number 517 from Madrid. Uh, muchas gracias por el mensaje, <laughs> for the message. I don't. Sp I speak. Uh, I speak weird Spanish. I'll do my best. Hablo el español de vez en cuando, cuando está necesario. There you go. That's that's what you get from me. <laughs> We're off nice. again, and it keeps it keeps on coming. Yeah. Bat smash is lined up for Namur yeah, against, against uh, Nenaza. Nenaza. So what do you tell me, Alexa? What do you see? Yeah, everybody is on the track. Uh, nobody, <laughs> nobody, nobody in the box. Nobody in the ah, box. Well, the pivot uh, of Madrid is on the box now, and uh, Nino uh, bat smash takes the lead. Coming in again for some more action. Yeah. Put in some more action then, and just puts, th just moves Madrid out of the way, and then the twist and turn around where you're like, where'd the jammer go? That is fantastic work for Bat Smash, as we recognize her how she plays, and is being told to probably keep going at the moment, which is a good idea because they want it. They want to stretch that lead out. You don't want to be sitting with uh, Madrid at the same amount of points, and we got a star stash. Uh, yeah, that the, was going the on the pivot of Madrid is is returning on the track, but call off. Yeah, that's I figured as much, so that's mm. why I didn't. Uh, by the time by the time you've said it, something's happened. We're gonna we're fixing the track too. That we have a lot of people today uh, fixing the track, making sure everything is okay. It's a good call. I say that just to see. That's eight points then for Namur. Namur, yeah, still really close. You know, we're gonna have. It's gonna this this is gonna be tight. This is gonna be a tight one. That's yeah. all I can say. Team, uh, sorry, uh, official timeout for official the moment. Timeout. But that just kind of means uh, an excuse to just uh, set things up. See, I could tell, I could mm. tell, I could tell. Okay. I saw the head ref of this game kind of point that out. 
that's what I do. We look, we look at everything. It's kind of difficult to look at that at the same time. And now we have Gilles against Dame Venino, and Dame Venino takes the lead very quickly. Uh, star pass for Namur, Pulp uh, take the cover. Oh my god, that was even quicker. Yeah. <laughs> Pulp, Pulp knows what to do, we're a big fan of Pulp too as well. We've seen a lot of things, well, big fan of Dark Pistol. Yes, yeah, Sailor Min uh, recycling uh, the Jammer of Madrid and Call Off. Yeah, that was quick, so no points scored there, star pass was completed. So a lot of star passes uh, in this game, I have to mm. say, I didn't see as many in the other games. That's okay. my, yeah, my yeah, that's so true. far. Uh, but also, I mean, yeah, also very busy in the box. <laughs> uh, then again, you know, that means that just teams are working as hard as they can. They're trying to get, you know, you're, it's, it's physical. You need to try and get out there. You need to try and get these people away from you that are in your way and stuff. And that takes up a lot of energy. And it's, it's uh, you know how it is, right? It's physical and mental at the same oh. time. Ninon takes the lead very quickly too at this jam. Always. <laughs> always. <laughs> Almost always, yeah. Yeah. Very good. That means they have more time to score points to get yeah, a bigger star, lead. Star pass for Madrid. Yep. So that was quick too as well. Yeah, Nino, number. let's have a good look on the in, on the inside. I'm telling you, the inside, that's yeah. where it's happening. That's where the magic happens. So uh, the number 86 of Madrid, uh, Hawaii take the cover and call off. Quick jam. Everyone really liked that one, but that was uh, at least one scoring pass. So for four and... Uh, Mo uh, Roller Derby Madrid got shut down in that one because they weren't able to do much. And you get you lose your concentration too as well when you have to reset a whole yeah. group of people. Reset the jam. Yeah, that, that just that causes people to lose a certain amount of concentration. It's perfectly normal. Six minutes left to go. This is this is exciting. <laughs> <laughs> it's really exciting. And now we have uh, Pulp, uh, Ujam for Namur uh, against uh, NG for Madrid. A cut. A cut for a blocker of Namur. It happens, that's number 24, Aline going to the box. Yeah. And uh, the two jammers uh, are on the pack, on the wall of each team. All over, all over the walls. Yeah. Look at that the through the middle, though. That's uh, some oh. excellent work for the lead, uh, Angie. It is, again. Doing a great job in the second half, I have to admit. Yeah. And uh, a star pass. No. In progress. In progress. Start by in progress. We have to. We have to make. Oh, hey. there we go. There we go. We got it. We got it. One blocker back in the meantime, and a uh, power jam. Yeah, it's a power jam and uh, a star pass uh, by Namur for uh, bat smash. Concentration coming in there, like bat smash. Like, okay, I need some help. You need to move everyone out of the way, and Namur does that. But Madrid's not going to let it go that easily. They've been really good with that so far this weekend. Bat smash still in the front, but look at that last person standing, just making it difficult. And we know when they go through because the audience is going to tell us. We're having yeah. a great audience here this weekend too as well. And she's returning on the track. Oh, a multiplayer. Bad behavior, no it happens, that's one blocker down. Mm. We're gonna run the. We're gonna run down the, the yeah. whole two minutes. And no, no lead uh, on this jam. Nobody. No, that's uh, why we're gonna run down for two minutes. Mm -hmm. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. Sometimes it happens that way. Mm -hmm. too. The audience is very happy about that online too, as well. They like uh, for the Madrid, the, the Madrid crow. They like. They're liking the power jams. We should order some more, but then that's not fair for Madrid. Yeah. Madrid though is very close to Namur's score, and I can just imagine they can smell it. But they need to get in there uh, because Namur is now way much up in front. Mm. As you can tell, eight points in yeah. that last jam against two for Madrid. Eighteen points uh, difference between the two teams. That's an easy one to calculate. <laughs> right. But tight game. Tight game. Tight <laughs> games are fun. They're fun. They, they mean that we can build a story around how Madrid can get up into Namur points or how Namur uh, wants to make sure they have enough points to win the game. So now uh, we have uh, Gilles against Nenaza. And uh, the jammer uh, are being uh, recycled by the blockers. Nice hits being dealt out there on the Madrid side of things and the blocker. That was a very nice one by Iron D. Doll for the fans out there because they've got fans watching. And uh, Gilles takes the lead. As the crowd goes wild. Yeah. 
Star Stash uh, for uh, Madrid and yeah, the NASA no. again. Yeah. But but Nenaza is being recycled. Yeah. Oh, I was worried. They were calling a pack. I thought it was a penalty, but it's not. We're all good. That's yeah. going to be no. The other penalty was for our friend R&D Doll going to the box. But look at that wall in front of Madrid. Just oh, it oh. good help there from yeah. Chaton. Chaton you, you like helped that, a eh? lot. Yeah. I recognize myself a little bit. You just want to mess up the game there and make sure that the jammer knows to to do something in the chaos to try and get through. Madrid holding it together though in front. Yeah, both Just of the jammer uh, yeah. is struggling now on the walls. Yeah, that's tough times. So. Gillis gets out. And the uh, first uh, scoring point for Gillis. Scoring pass, four points. This is fantastic. Everyone, the crew here that, uh, of course, from Namir getting a bit excited as well. Yeah. I can imagine. And they're just, yeah, you want to run the, I've been here, yeah, let's just say they want to run it long, make sure they can get up in front. That's kind of what we're doing. Madrid needs to just get back up there, but we don't have that much time left to work the magic uh, on the side of Madrid. Madrid, yeah, again, this is their second game in a row. Yeah. I can see how they can feel about it at the moment. Nenaza not scoring any points as that jam yeah. ends. It was a uh, all uh, two minutes jam. Tough, that's a lot of work, yeah. yeah. Two minutes can be a long time when, uh, yeah. when you're stuck in the back. <laughs> that should be a good, two minutes can be long. It is, it is. It really feels like an eternity, I can imagine. <laughs> Fantastic jam by Namur for 10 points. No points, unfortunately, for uh, Madrid in this last one. Not much, too, too much time left here in this third yeah, one. Yeah, one, one minute left. And uh, it's Ninon against Dame Veneno. And Dame Veneno takes the lead very quickly. Oh, what? Come on, point. We need Madrid, you need points now. That's what we need to happen. <laughs> Madrid, you need some points. Let's see how this pans out. Yeah, Ninon, Ninon the pass front. Too. But let's have a look at Madrid only because they're the underdog and they're the ones that are going to need stuff. Uh, oh, with a, a nice a little, little apex, apex gem. A baby one. Yeah. A wee one. And a call off. Call off. For so four points. Four points for Madrid. Yeah, because if they keep going, Nemir is going to get points too. It's, it's, it's really difficult. As you know, it's tough tough times. And it's hard as a blocker too. You want to give your jammers the most opportunity to get through. Mm. It will be the last jam, perhaps, no? Never say that. Okay. <laughs> because it probably is, yeah. but we just we just try and leave it out. That's no big deal. You're probably right, but we never want to jinx it because it happens. Mm -hmm. So let's have a good look. Uh, we're going to run down the jam clock. That is, in fact, true. Uh, bat smash against uh, Dom Veneno. Yeah. And uh, the two jammer are struggling on the walls. And Dom Veneno takes the lead. Strong hit uh, by uh, Madrid Brokers on the Namur uh, Jammer. Oh yeah, you want to kind of put all the rest of energy that you have. There's a star pass going on for Namur in the meantime. Yeah. It's Chaton, it's your friend. Yeah. Chaton, Chaton is the star. The yeah. There you go. But Namur, let's be fair, are up in front at the moment too. And, and they're very the excited. Unofficial score for the moment is Namur Roller Derby 142 for the win and Roller uh, Derby uh, Madrid 114. Still official score, so we're going to keep talking to you until we make sure we have a final score. Mm. The reason's always simple. We can't end it. You can't turn something back if there's a, a points difference, as you know. So we then, we just keep on going. So let's. Uh, we saw uh, some fantastic work by all the jammers that we saw. We saw Nino, mm. Gilles. Uh, we saw Pepe earlier today. We didn't see them so much. No, uh, Pepe uh, don't, uh, doesn't play. Fair enough. Game. And then uh, we saw a lot of Nen we saw a lot of Nenaza, Nenaza, uh, Nenaza uh, Paola, Paola as well, and uh, Dom Veneno a few a few times as well too mm. as well. What a game! I have to admit, this was uh, something else. And there it is, the final score. Alexia, tell us, read yeah. us, tell so us all about it. The final score of this game is 142 for Namur and 116 for Madrid.
Voilà, 142, euh, 142 Namur et 116, 116 pour Madrid. Fantastic score final. Thank you very much, everyone who is watching it. Merci And uh, don't go away. We're going to be having some more roller derby at uh, 6.15. Vienna Roller Derby will be playing their second game against the Auvergnac Roller Derby that will be playing their second game as well. So that is a wonderful win for Namur. That's two wins for Namur so far. Yep. One for two Madrid. Wins. Very, very exciting. Yeah. I am excited. So we're good. Everyone around us is really, really excited. So say hello to you. This was Alexa's first time. She did a great yeah, job. Thank you. Sen, she already has a fan club here, so that was really, really <laughs> nice. We've got our colleague uh, Arnaud. Arnaud, do you want to come say hello to everybody? You have to just, just wave because no one can hear you. So there we go. So our colleague, our hall monitor, Arnaud, c'est bon. Merci beaucoup. There we go, all the announcers. We got all five of us. That's fantastic. Everyone's here. We're going to have a party. This was an excellent game, lots of close things. And now we're just going to stop and we're going to leave you. And we're going to, yeah, say hello. Look, there we go. Hey, all the announcers. Hi, look, uh, oh my God. Look, they're all here. We're all here, all five of us. Tournament head announcer, toxic, uh, toxic lady. Y'all crazy. So cut us off, uh, crew, and we will get back to you for the next game.